welcome to my channel. If you are new, I'm so glad that you're here with me today. Um, as you can see, I am in my hallway um, leading into my laundry room. And then right here is my guest powder room that is downstairs. Today, I will be cleaning and packing all at the same time. Um, first, I'm gonna go into the powder room. It's really, really small, so it's gonna be a really good, easy clean. I'm gonna pack up everything in there, except for the toilet paper, I'll leave that in there. And then we're gonna move to the laundry room. I'm gonna do a little laundry, and then I'm going to clean up and pack my laundry room. So you're in for some packing motivation if you're packing or need to just unpack or anything like that, or just to clean, or just wanna sit and relax and hang out with me. So thank you for being here, and let's go ahead and get started. So here I am cleaning off the mirror. I'm using the spray away glass cleaner with a microfiber cloth and then I'm going to wipe down the sink and the toilet with the Fabuloso wipes that I absolutely love. And it's so much easier to go ahead and clean the toilets with it because you just wipe it down and you can throw it away. So that's why I really really love using my wipes for is in the bathroom. Now using the Lysol brand new day it's an all-purpose cleaner but it does say it kills 99% of viruses and bacteria so I love to use this in the bathrooms as well and it's in the mango and hibiscus smell and it smells so good this is such a weird angle so I will not be showing you me cleaning the toilet because the camera was all up in my bottom but you do get the gist of it. I did clean the toilet. Now that I've deep cleaned this bathroom, I have closed the bathroom down for the whole house so no one has been using this bathroom. They've been coming to our master bedroom to use the bathroom. So this bathroom is now closed because I'm not going to re-clean it again. And here's my packing section in the entryway of my house guys a good tip that I found out is if you are ever moving or if you ever need some big moving boxes you can go up to your local U-Haul and just ask them if they have recycle boxes and you get boxes for free and they're really nice boxes they're usually from actual U-Haul they even have the wardrobe boxes that are really really expensive but you just get them for free and don't even have to pay for them so that's just a good tip I also have a neighborhood page where I went on and asked if anybody had any moving boxes and so I did get a lot of boxes from that as well so so far we have not had to pay for any boxes so tell me, tell me what you want me to do. I can be good or be not in. I know a lot of us have these little plastic grocery bags laying around somewhere in your house, but these work really well too when you're packing up and you don't have to worry about using newspapers and things like that. But now I'm moving into the laundry room, doing laundry, of course, every single day. So I'm gonna do my laundry for the day. I try to do one load a day. Um, it's not really working for me, but yeah, that was my goal. So I'm gonna go ahead and put my load in and then I'm going to completely pack up this laundry room and you guys get to be here with me while I do it.
from your body So tell me, tell me what you want me to do I can be good or be naughty I packed up all of my oils in the plastic bag and I did double plastic it. But this is my little oil holder that I have in here. I wanted to show you. I did purchase it off of Amazon. That is the name of it. And it was a really good price. I believe it was about less than $20. I can't remember the exact price, but it's less than $20. And it holds a lot of oil. My new laundry room is a lot smaller than this laundry room. Um, it does not have a sink, so I will definitely miss having a sink in here. And I'm not sure how I'm going to be able to organize it. It does have a hanging shelf in there, so that would be very helpful. But this is going to be a fun journey to figure out new organization ways in all the parts of my house. Like everything is completely different than what I'm used to. The pantry is completely different, so I'm gonna have to use different baskets in there. So it's gonna be exciting to go ahead and get the pantry together, just everything pretty much in the house. So if you are new, be sure to subscribe to the channel so that you can go on this journey with me and get some new ideas on organization and decorating. Now I'm moving my laundry beads over to this container that actually has a, a um, lid on it so that would be able to keep it nice and contained. And then I started noticing that I have a lot of batteries so I went into the office. This is my daughter's um, pencil case holder that they do not use so I went ahead and used this for my batteries and it worked out really well. So sometimes you don't have to always go out and go buy things, just look in your house just to look for different ideas to put things in just to keep it all together in one particular area but oh my goodness girl guys my laundry room is looking so empty right now <laughs> I went in there to do laundry today and it just it did not motivate me to do laundry at all so it's just it's gonna be fun to go ahead and get out of the house so that I can make my space the way that I like it to keep me motivated to do laundry because it's such a hard chore for me to stay on top of There's something I have to say I love you when I hate you And I hope you feel the same Come on, get a closer, baby Please don't walk away Best friend didn't care about the rules, good on the weekends. I'll be in fools, drift in the deep space. So brave and so stupid, just like the movies. How it's gonna stay in the fight with you. Just thinking we would do this until we couldn't do it. Each and every high, every night with you. You and me so clueless.
gonna go ahead and wash the containers that I had my Tide in and the scent beads in as well. That way, if I wanna use them for something else, I'll be able to do that and won't have to worry about washing them and already be nice and clean for when we do um, unpack it. I did go ahead and pack up the tools but I did end up leaving the box open because I'm pretty sure we will be needing a drill or a screwdriver or just something out of there so I did not close the box but now I'm taking off these little wall clippy hangy things that I purchased from Target and it really did come off easily and it did not mess up the paint so I will go ahead and get more of the command strips for the back of them and I will put them up in the new house as well. I did not take down the vacuum cleaner yet. We will probably do that the uh, couple days before we get ready to move. But now I'm gonna go ahead and get this floor vacuumed and mopped down. I'm wiping down Bambi's little mat that we keep her food dishes on. And then we'll pretty much be done with the laundry room once I get it all vacuumed and mopped up. I did go ahead and leave products out that I will be needing for the rest of the week, but that's pretty much everything that's left in here. It never hit you Our conversation takes to Paying it some interest From time to time Inside all that greatness In all of your adventures You're all alone Hold up, hold up, baby I can sit beside you While you're going on About your simple life now I'm going to go ahead and vacuum this hallway and then I'm going to break out my mop. Um, all I'm using today is the bowl in hot water from the kettle and Fabuloso, so nothing fancy. I'm going to go ahead and get this mopped up and this will be the end of this video. Guys, I hope you enjoyed packing and cleaning with me because I will have another one out here pretty soon. Um, if you are new, do not forget to push that subscribe button and leave me a comment so that I can get to know you. Tell me where you're from and what you are doing while you are watching. I'm always interested in knowing what you guys are doing while you're watching my videos. But I'm so thankful that you guys are here with me. It means so much to me and I'm so happy to bring you on this journey with me. Until next time, bye-bye.